so pranam swami ji uh, this is yet another session where we thought of having some feedback and discussion and so this session it will be a question answer session and whosoever has any question regarding any aspect of spiritual practice they they are free to ask and we will have discussion on that and swami ji will guide us so the session is open now and i would like to welcome all the uh, participants so please ask your question so akhil ji reddy ji if you want to ask your question please you can ask anybody अखिल आपका सुना ही नहीं दे रहा है यू कैन टाइप करके मुझे भेज सकते हैं ओके ओके हाँ अभी अभी सुनाई दे रहा है बोलिए तो my question is how can one intensify the spiritual practices so question is how to intensify spiritual to omid bolo omid and sir do iske baad main kya okay. iska baad reddy punit mukta all should speak try to give answer new way पर्सन हू इज अपियरिंग फॉर एग्जाम नो इफ आई नो माई केमिस्ट्री इज वीक देन आई विल लुक आफ्टर more duration for study i will meet another my teacher who is a chemistry teacher to teach me and i will go to chemistry and sit in library and try to uh, get more out of it so more uh, people who are interested in chemistry probably is the right uh, environment for me to progress in that subject and also the chemistry teacher can help me and i will not spend time in other things other than chemistry so if i am so much goal focused automatically it should intensify my study so if goal is clear i think path will be automatically clear next next give the answer punit mukta then ready yeah namaste swami ji this is punit yes uh, aapne kai baar humko bataya hai ki we have to develop a love for our objective aapne apna jo lakshya hai uske prati humko prem jagrat karna hai a divana pan pagal pan उस लेवल तक के जाना और फिर वो इंटेंसिफाई हो जाता है तो आ, हमने भी ऐसे देखा हमको तो कुछ नहीं पता था आपने एसडीएम के रास्ते पे बताया और करते करते प्रैक्टिस करते करते इतना मजा आने लग गया इतना मजा आने लग गया कि अब छूटता ही नहीं है अब तो लाइफ ही पूरा चेंज हो गया तो इट इज इट इज इट इज ब्लिसफुल मैडनेस ब्लिसफुल लव थैंक यू सो मच then ready yeah pranam maharaj uh, this is ready yeah as uh, as you said in your uh, previous classes that sdm is the root to strengthen the intensity 
एंड ये क्वेश्चन मुझे भी सताती है महाराज एंड दैट हाउ टू इंटेंसिफाई एंड हाउ टू इंक्रीज द वेल्थ ऑफ पीस सो इंटेलेक्चुअली आई नो दैट इट इज एस डी एम एंड थ्रू प्रैक्टिस एंड एज अदर सेड लव फॉर द गोल इफ द मोर इफ द लव फॉर द गोल इज मोर देन इंटेंसिटी एंड the depth of uh, practice can be increased so i would like to hear more uh, about this maraj that's all maraj mukta do you want to add anything no maraj most of the points are cleared i think we need more uh, diligent introspection i feel as we uh, go on after some time some years in practice i feel sometime some for some period i tend to become a little complacent but if i go on uh, then more introspection shows me that there is still i'm lacking so i think okay ha uh, more satsang and more practice is required then few practical points to intensify love for the idea or spiritual practice first make a sankalp in the morning when you get up after your japa or meditation or still early in the morning make determination sankalp that today i should remember god during my work when you are in the busy in the working field sometimes when there is a desire i should remember the god once an old day say 15 7 8 years you are working and there is a little bit gap or there is no more stress in the mind that time you can take the name or remember the god once at least make a sankalp determination second determination is that today i will increase my duration of time for japa and meditation every day 2 minutes 3 minutes then third sankalp or determination that when about there is a deflection of the mind or deviation of the mind or restless that time i should always think that ultimate goal of human life is peace god realization not this material things or objective these are the means by which we can achieve that the thar sankalpa is that clear that i should always think this world is temporary world is temporary that gives some might kind of boosting of the mind that it help you even though you are working you have to work you have to live even you are in a world but this thinking world is nothing nothing not true at all perishable 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 that strong your mind or the love for the god or and that increase the uh, love for the god this temporary 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 this is and uh, this is kind of thinking and second point introspection introspection is essential unless you know which is right and which is wrong 
then we cannot erase them, just like a mirror. We hold the mirror before our face. Why? Because from that mirror, we can understand, we can point out which are the imperfection is there. So you can perfect them, remove them, add them. So mirror showing you what is the imperfection in your face. Similarly, introspection or thinking, just like a mirror to show you, these are the wrong, these are the wrong things. These are the wrong things. So you can able to erase them, rectify them. Unless you know your fault, you cannot rectify it. Just like it's uh, holding mirror before you, you are detecting your faults or uh, imperfection. So night at least before sleeping, just sit down 10, 15 minutes and try to introspect thing about the whole day works. Some are good, some are bad, which is positive, which is negative, that will be reflected during your introspection. Uh, when you see it before going to sleep, 10 minutes. So this introspection will help you to rectify, at least to detect which are the wrong things you have done, even the thoughts, not only in the physical level, because whenever you did the work behind, what is the thought? So thought is the important. If thought is good, then I do the good work. If thought is bad, I is to do the bad ones. Because thought is, uh, in, uh, thought is dictating us to implement to physical level. Whether I go to that particular person, the thought is like, no, this person is good, this person is not good. So thought is dictating you whether you go to the, that person or this person. So, Introspection is very, very important to intensify your spiritual practice, to love for the God and uh, progress in the spiritual. But this night at least 10 minutes and morning two, three sun call first, you can take determination which, uh, which help you to grow your spirituality that you can decide that everything, no. Just ordinary people, they can take the sankalpa. 10 minutes, I will think on the God and I will not take a, um, I will not indulge in the negative thoughts, on the positive, everything. See, negative, positive is most important. What are the thoughts uh, emerging from you? That is positive or negative. When it is a positive, your battery is charged. When it comes negative, battery is discharging. That you remember. Even you know that person is very bad and cruel. And thought, naturally negative thought will come to them. Whenever you see that particular person, negative thoughts suddenly come. And due to that, your mind is on best. Because Seeing that particular person, that mind is unrest. So that is your choice. Seeing that particular man, you will disturb your mind with negative reaction, or you will ignore it so that you will not disturb your mind. That is your choice. So they say, Thinking also it is your choice. After thinking, there is a reaction. So this reaction, it is your choice. The examples I have given you that everybody knows is a bad person, bad character, these things. Okay, come to the and near me. 
or in front of you. Then that is your choice. If you hear so many things about him, so natural negativity will come. That is your choice. But if you ignore them, so negativity, negative thoughts will not emerge from you. So that is the choice how to react to any situation. It may be positive, it may be negative, but sometimes practically it is necessary to throw negative thoughts or negative action. There are very few, but unknowingly suddenly comes a bad person, you know, everybody says, so bad thoughts come in the mind. That actually decreases your energy. Whenever bad thoughts come, means your power reduced. So I should not, okay, since bad man is away from me, he is not talking to me. I ignore them to go another. So that negativity should not come within to disturb me. So there are a few points, practical guidelines. I think if you follow, you can intensify our spiritual growth and spiritual progress. If anything you want to add or not able to understand the points what I discussed, you can ask now. Thank you, Maharaj. Very practical tips and very elaborative answer. Uh, one more thing I would like to uh, ask Maharaj, uh, please more elaborate on the positive and negative things. Because we come in con uh, contact with certain thoughts, people. So this criteria must be very helpful for all of us. In the order See, here. positivity, this is from inside, within. This is positive or negative. Generally, positive means some kind of attraction, joy, no disturbance of the mind. Negative means that if there is a disturbance of the mind, repulsion of the mind. See, we are coming, we, we are hearing so many wars, society, house, in the wars, wars, which bola hai, suna hai, sunne ke baad, तुमको क्या लगेगा नहीं ये तो बहुत गलत बात जैसा गलत बात बता रहा जैसा फॉर एग्जांपल्स तुमने पूछा किसी ने पूछा कि ये मैंने पहना है ड्रेस कैसा है बता तो सामान सेल नहीं मुझे अच्छा नहीं लगा ठीक नहीं सो नेचुरली यू आर अनहैप्पी एंड यू मे नॉट लाइक दिस पर्सन बोले क्या बोल रहा है so this is negativity starts. He acha nahi bula hai. So so negativity will come. Jo acha bula, thik bula. According, according to your desires and mind. So they are positive thoughts. Thoughts is full of joy, praise, the tense and free. Ar kisi ne tumko kuj bol diya hai. The mind, mind is full of tension. These are all negative feeling. So whenever some people uh, say any remarks against you, you should think this is his opinion. I should not be disturbed, I should be neutral. Even though he insults me. I should try to be neutral without any reaction. If you show the reaction in the, in the mind, mind, and you are not expressing it, that is negativity. Because dislike and like, I dislike him, so negativity comes. I like him, positivity comes. I like going to the temple, positivity. I do not like go to the cinema. So this is negativity comes. So positive, negative, EJ also measurements stick of uh, mind condition. Mind will be 
peace, hand, esteem. As children, they say that is negativity. So this is the subtle way, but slowly you can understand which is positive and which is negative. But one thing, remember that to live in this world, sometimes negativity is required to save yourself, not to harm others. I think you understand this point. Negativity also is required. Aggressive is required. So if, if, though even it's uh, from outside is like a cruel, but it is necessary to, to save yourself. But other times you should not give so much negative reaction in the mind. That is your negative reaction comes means that is your energy loses, decreases. If positive comes, energy increases. So these are the subtle things, but if you go on thinking in this line, I think you will be able to understand which is positive and which is negative. Another is simple way, positive thinking, and uh, this, you are mar energetic, mind is very peaceful. When mind is very peaceful, we are energetic. When mind is not peaceful, you are not so energetic. That means you are trapped with the negative feelings coming within. So you are not so um, feeling so good. So this is the way you can. Yes, Mara. Thank think, you very much. And let's go. Yes, uh, Puneet, uh, Redduji, Sudipto, any question? Uh, Swamiji, this is Puneet. Yes. Uh, I, I'll just switch on my video also. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, Swamiji, a uh, few days back in my meditation, uh, 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 by God's grace, a very wonderful, a beautiful term came to me, uh, especially how to handle negative people. So, worldly people, negative people, sometimes uh, people with ill intentions, uh, whom we have to encounter as part of the routine life. So, the term came was Supta Sadhak, dormant seekers. So I started seeing them as dormant seekers. Ye log abhi nahi jagrit huye hain, par agle janam mein, do janam baad, char janam baad shayad jagrit honge, par ye bhi hamari category kahi hain. There was a time jab hum bhi supt seekers te, hamara progress hua, hamko guru mile, hamko sahi rasta mila, ham log jag gaye. Aise ye log bhi shayad do janam ke baad jagenge, do saal baad jagenge, paach saal baad jagenge, jab unka karmic cycle khatam hoga, tab wo jagenge. So I saw such a man ko bhot shanti mila, aur bhot saare jo logo ko jinko thoda sa handle karne mein thoda ट्रिक आता था दिक्कत आता था वो बड़े प्यार से प्रैक्टिकल वे में हैंडल हो गया हंसते हुए हैंडल हो गया कि अच्छा 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 आप ऐसा कह रहे हैं आ, तो ठीक है जैसे कल ही का मैं बताता हूँ कल मेरे को एक कहीं शादी में जाना था आ, तो वहां पे गए तो वहां पे उन लोगों ने केक दिया तो सबके हाथ में एक एक केक का पीस दिया तो वो उसके बाद उन्होंने कहा सब लोग ऐसा टोस्ट रेस करेंगे तो ऐसा केक खाया तो केक खा के कुछ अजीब सा लगा तो मेरे पड़ोस में जो बगल में खड़े थे हमारे मित्र मैंने उनसे पूछा केक में रम पड़ा है क्या तो बोले हाँ रम है अच्छा है ना केक तो बगल वाला भी इधर वाले भी जो खड़े थे वो भी बोले हाँ अच्छा है ना केक अभी मैं क्या बोलता उनको कि अच्छा है कि क्या है पर देन दैट मेरे को एकदम से फिर वो याद आया कि डॉर्मेंट सीकर तो भाई ठीक है उनको उनके हिसाब से जैसे वो उनको लगता है कि ये ठीक है तो ठीक है भाई खत्म कर दो बात हमने बाकी का केक का पीस छोड़ दिया हमने कहा बहुत अच्छा है बहुत अच्छा है एंड देन विद स्माइल लेट द मैटर को तो इस प्रकार से छोटे मैटर्स और बड़े मैटर्स भी वो सुप्त सीकर या डॉर्मेंट सीकर है सुप्त सुप्त साधक या डॉर्मेंट सीकर so that has helped me thank you this yeah. is just i wanted to share very good very good acha in this connection what is a puni to and one point is there that i don't like sab batata hai main kya batau kharab lagne se bhi humko bolna padega bhi acha hai this is the one situation comes so everybody praising this particular cake but i don't like it but from inside i am thinking it is not bad uh, so good As life, I think. But sab bolna, I have said. 
बच्चा है दिस हैपेंस जस्ट टू प्लीज अदर्स बट इफ यू थिंक वेरी सीरियसली that your thought is telling you this is not right but by influence of the other thoughts influence of the other saying you tell them no no it is a good so there is a difference between your thought and one that is also uh cause of unrest of the mind disturbance of the mind that is happening in the society my thought is different that is why sri ramakrishna says thought and word should be the same man mo ek karna but if you think seriously my thought is something we say something but spiritual seeker strive slowly the reduce this gap between thought and words so that is also disturbance of the mind ani ji because mind and you are your mind is telling something the moment you say with the influence of the others uh, uh, social uh, tension or social Pressure. That time you see the mind is under. So that way, another way you can think, you are cheating yourself. You cheating yourself because thought is different. Just to please them, you are telling lie. You are lying yourself. So these are so many things is there, but. you go on practicing and intense spirituality depends of intense thinking like this introspection so night at least you see this introspection see these things will come out flash in the mind then you can rectify it but there is a very subtle point when omit came i told him that this is a very very subtle point came to hear the explain live uh, elaborately but punit the kek diya sab bol raha hai mujhe acha nahi lag raha tab bhi bolna pada par koi bhi aisa bola so this flash in the mind the thought and words are different and try to minimize this gap so whatever come thoughts i try to speak always it is not possible in the society however it is possible you can do that is also you are cheating others if you keep in the mind you if you are alert so you can avoid that suppose 20 times you have done this thought is different what is it but you are alert no here no necessary i will please you for your coming i will take what is the necessary to please you but some cases it is necessary so in the boss is there you are working that is true in day 20 cases were there but you are 22 cases are there because of the uh, social boundaries and because you will be in the danger to lose the job so that is a very subtle point also we should think analyze then what is thought i should express they may not like it. what to do why will cheat others why will steal i will tell lie that is a very dangerous you are you must think on this particular things mind was thought was to the same i think next day we should discuss on particular point thoughts and words because more discussion is required I yes swami ji definitely 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 this is very correct what you have highlighted this is very very this introspection and this uh, observation is very very important and uh, uh, thoughts and words the gap has to be minimum it has to be there has to be zero gap and zero tolerance for gap that is also very important 
so sometimes we get in in worldly works we get caught in certain situations which uh, where we are helpless so even in those places for example yesterday when i uh, when this cake came so i just uh, took one bite and then i realized that there is some substance in it which is not of my liking and then i left the remaining of the piece so uh, and and i didn't reply to any of those people uh, so they just said that this is good so we just i just smiled at them because there is no point explaining it to them that why i can't have this cake Yes. So, uh, so, so I just let it go because it is a public function. There are so many people, hundreds of people over there. I've just gone for some social, social reason, and uh, not to create any kind of a fuss. Just quietly do it and come back to your uh, uh, thing. So that is why the supta sadhak, what I said, uh, dormant seeker, and that concept has really helped me uh, manage such kind of situations. in home also at uh, in family also there are uh, people who have got worldly interest and they've got worldly uh, uh, orientation and when i have to speak to them when i have to uh, convince them or, or on their point and understand things from their perspective so it helps uh, it has helped it is really helping me very uh, uh, very wonderfully ye theek hai ye bhi kabhi aayenge inko bhi kabhi spirituality mein interest aayega to abhi inko empathy ke sath handle kare the word is empathy ki अंग्रेजी का जो शब्द है हिंदी में सहिष्णुता ये ठीक है इनको भी कभी साधना का चस्का लगेगा इनको भी कभी इस रास्ते पे आएंगे तो चलो इनको अभी थोड़ा सपोर्ट करो इनको आगे बढ़ने दो काम चलने दो अपना भी काम चलाओ इनका भी चलाओ तो विद दैट काइंड ऑफ अ को एक्सिस्टेंस या थैंक यू स्वामी जी बट ये डेफिनेटली यू सेड इट करेक्टली and uh, we will close uh, one point i just want to share because i had this visit and swami ji highlighted and there was this discussion on greed and selfishness and money and uh, how people are getting respect so swami ji told me wonderfully during our morning walk he said uh, see one must remember that this body is going to become clay one day and we will not carry anything with this neither money nor no aim fame recognition nothing of this so what we will be carrying forward is our own karma and our own sanskara and that's it so when we are dealing in the world we should be very careful about what karma we are doing and what sanskara we are generating we are the maker of our own fate so we need not bother what others are doing not doing how much money how much name how much recognition how much criticism how much ego so if our focus is like this i think we can handle many other situations as well thank you so much so we'll okay okay uh, yes 